So here's more proof of the corruption of the Communist Party of China. And this sheds light on the true meaning of socialism with Chinese characteristics. What are those Chinese characteristics? Well, I'll tell you. It's called guanxi, which can be translated as relations or connections. But in the context of the Chinese Communist Party, guanxi only means one thing. Corruption. Favors. This is also how business is done in China. Guanxi. To establish a good relationship with your business partners, you need to basically do them other favors, like giving them gifts. And eventually, those gifts become bribes, or power or influence in the Communist Party of China. That's what happens when these business partners, so-called, are from the Communist Party of China, aka the Shanghai Gang. So let's use the PLA, the Army of the Communist Party of China, as an example. In order to rise through the ranks, you don't actually have to prove your worth like in other legitimate armies. You just bribe them. Guanxi. Give them favors, give them a cigarette, give them a drink, or just give them good old money. That's why there's a lot of censorship in China, because they're hiding all the money laundering, all the bribes and graft and corruption. That's why all these so-called rules and regulations mean absolutely nothing when you have money. Because unlike in the US where you have to do some roundabout lobbying to vote for legislation that will help the company, in China, just like in a lot of other corrupt countries, you just give them money and all of a sudden, the laws don't apply to you. And this is why corrupt cronies like the Shanghai Mafia hate Xi Jinping so much. And they want to brainwash the whole world into thinking that Xi Jinping's anti-corruption campaign is just like another Stalinist purge when it truly is an anti-corruption campaign. Because corruption is deep-rooted in Chinese culture in the form of guanxi. Corruption, bribes, graft, favors. And again, Xi Jinping is actually putting the rule of law in the Chinese constitution like other developed countries. It's just under the name Xi Jinping thought, which will make you believe that it's another Stalinist dictatorship. Because we all know China has no rule of law right now. It's rule of guanxi rule of socialism with Chinese characteristics. So now you know that socialism with Chinese characteristics actually means corruption.